Beats me, Mikey. Let's see what they want before jumping to any conclusions. Good evening, officers. What can we do for you? Good evening, Mr. JJ. Mr. Mikey, we've got a situation on our hands. We need your help investigating some unusual cases. Unusual cases, you say? You know we're not exactly the Hardy Boys, right? What's in it for us? Mr. JJ, Mr. Mikey, there's been a spike in mysterious occurrences, things that have the town puzzled. We've heard you're the best at cracking unconventional cases. The chief wants you at the station ASAP. Mikey, looks like we've got a new gig. Let's hear them out at the station. Officer, lead the way. We're all ears, and maybe you'll get your answers. Officers, we appreciate the trust you have in our skills. But you see, Mikey and I have kids at home. We understand your concerns. Mr. JJ, Mr. Mikey, your friends here at the station are more than willing to keep an eye on your kids while you work on cracking these cases. That's a relief. We'll need your assurance that our children will be safe and sound. We can't afford any slip-ups on that front. All right, we're in. But remember, any harm comes to our kids, and you'll be dealing with more than just mysterious cases. Lead us to the station, and let's get to the bottom of this. Mikey, these police uniforms make us look like the real deal. It's like playing cops and robbers, but for grown-ups. Yeah, and surprisingly, they fit quite well. Now, about the weapons. You think we should grab some heat, just in case things get dicey? Better to be safe than sorry. Let's check with our friends here if they've got any spare firepower. Can't hurt to have a little extra protection, given the circumstances. Hand us a couple of those, officer. Can't have too much insurance, especially when dealing with the unknown. Now we're ready for action. Lead us to these mysterious cases, and let's see if we can bring some order to this chaos. So, what's the scoop on these spider sightings? Any specifics we should know about? Yeah, like, are we talking about your average garden variety spiders or something out of a horror movie? Well, it seems folks around here are reporting an unusual surge in spider activity. Not just your run-of-the-mill spiders, mind you, but swarms of them crawling out of the woodwork, so to speak. Sounds like a case of arachnophobia turned up to 11. All right, Mikey. Looks like we're off to investigate some eight-legged mysteries. Let's roll. Spider Central, here we come. Hope you're not afraid of a little leggy action, partner. Time to weave our way through this web of intrigue and see what's really going on. Well, this is a spider paradise, Mikey. I've never seen so many eight-legged critters in one place. It's like a scene from a horror flick. Seriously, JJ, I knew we signed up for weird cases, but a spider convention? This is something else. Hold up, JJ. That ruined building in the picture, I've seen it before. It's not far from here on the next island over. Seriously? How did you come across it? And why didn't we know about this earlier? I stumbled upon it during one of our late night explorations. Didn't think much of it at the time, but now it seems like that place might be ground zero for our arachnid friends. Well, ain't that a stroke of luck? Lead the way, Mikey. We've got a spider mystery to unravel and I'm not letting those creepy crawlies take over our town. Well, look at that, a jet ski. Quick getaway, huh? Hey, officers, we heard you're on the case. Mind if we join you? We've got a thing for men in uniform. Uh, not now, ladies. We've got serious police work to do. I can't believe those girls tried to derail our mission with their little crushes. Seriously, we're not here for a fan club. Yeah, it's like they've never seen a cop before. Well, look who fell for our little trap. Ladies, we're kind of on a mission here. Can't be playing around? Sorry, but we've got a spider situation to handle. Can't afford any distractions. You'll have to figure your own way out. We can't risk it. Our duty comes first. You'll thank us when there are fewer spiders crawling around. Time to get back on that watercraft, Mikey. We've wasted enough time. Spider territory awaits, and we can't let anyone slow us down. We've got a spider mystery to unravel. You'll need to find your own way out of this little predicament. Full speed ahead, JJ. Spider Island awaits, and I've got a feeling it's hiding some dark secrets. Hold on tight, Mikey. We're about to uncover the truth behind this arachnid invasion. No more distractions, just spiders and mysteries. These waves are like nature's speed bumps. Hang on, partner. We're about to hit the next island. Well, would you look at that? It's like a scene straight out of a disaster movie. Those blocks are crumbling like they've got a vendetta against stability. Definitely not your average wear and tear. Something's causing this destruction. And it's not just time taking its toll. But the million dollar question remains. How do we bring this house of blocks down without causing more chaos? Looks like we've got our work cut out for us, Mikey. Mikey, check this out. Looks like we've got some dynamite. 
This could be our ticket to unraveling the mysteries inside that crumbling fortress. Dynamite, huh? Now we're talking. Let's set this baby up strategically, blow those blocks, and see what secrets they've been hiding. Careful, though. We don't want to bring the whole island down on us. Well, that was quite the entrance. Down we go. Ready for whatever awaits us, JJ? Let's do this, Mikey. What the heck is this place? Those skeletons are giving me the creeps. Looks like we stumbled upon a graveyard or something. These skeletons aren't here for a tea party, that's for sure. More blocks to break? Looks like this place is a maze of secrets. Let's use the dynamite again and see what's behind door number two. Agreed, Mikey. If there's more to uncover, might as well blast our way through. Light it up and brace yourself. Well, that explosion was one way to make an entrance. Let's see what lies beyond these newly shattered blocks. Jackpot! Looks like we've stumbled upon a pirate's treasure trove with all these golden blocks. Talk about hitting the mother load. This is incredible, Mikey. But we can't just haul all this gold out of here without knowing the full story. What if it's stolen or connected to something more significant? True, JJ. We're cops, not treasure hunters. Let's gather evidence, take some photos, and then we'll report our findings to the station. They can decide what to do with this pirate booty. What in the world, zombies? Seriously? I thought we were dealing with spiders and skeletons, not the undead. Where did these zombies come from? No time to question it now, JJ. Grab that weapon, and let's send these zombies back to the grave. That was unexpected. Are we dealing with a supernatural pirate curse now? I don't know, but I'm not sticking around to find out. Another wave of zombies? This is turning into a nightmare. We can't run now, JJ. We're in this together. Let's fight them off and get out of here in one piece. You've got it, Mikey. We're a team, and we're getting out of here alive. Thanks for having my back, JJ. I couldn't have done it without you. No problem, Mikey. We're partners to the end. Now let's get out of this nightmare and back to the surface before any more surprises come our way. Looks like we're stuck down here without any stairs. We'll have to MacGyver our way out of this mess. Great. Just what we needed. All right, let's find some blocks, build a makeshift staircase, and get out of this underground labyrinth. Agreed. It's time to channel our inner architects. With enough blocks and determination, we'll make it out of here. Almost there, JJ. Just a few more blocks and we'll be back in the fresh air. Keep going, Mikey. We're not giving up now. We've come too far to let a few zombies hold us back. That was quite the climb, Mikey. Remind me to add surviving zombie attacks and building a staircase to our detective resumes. No kidding, JJ. We faced some bizarre challenges tonight. Now, let's get out of here and report all of this to the station. They won't believe half of what we've encountered. Well, that was one heck of an adventure, JJ. I never thought we'd be dealing with spiders, skeletons, pirate treasure, and zombies all in one night. Tell me about it, Mikey. We've got evidence, photos, and a story that'll make our chief's head spin. Let's get back to the station and fill them in on the madness we just experienced. I can already imagine the looks on their faces when we recount this. Chief, you won't believe the night we just had. Spiders, skeletons, pirate treasure, and even zombies. It's like a horror movie down there. Spiders, skeletons, and zombies? Are you two pulling my leg? Not at all, Chief. Chief, what's going on out there? Why are all the officers in a rush? There's a major crisis unfolding. Mikey and JJ, we need all hands on deck. Get to the helicopter ASAP. There's been a massive incident, and we're sending everyone to deal with it. On it, Chief. Lead the way. A military chopper? This is getting more serious by the minute. At least they're pulling out all the stops. Lead the way to that helicopter. We're ready for whatever comes our way. This chopper is top-notch, fully secure. It'll take you straight to the crime scene. Buckle up, and let's get this show on the road. Never thought we'd be riding in a military chopper. Hope this crime scene is something we can handle. Strap in, partner. The only way to find out is to get there. Let's see what awaits us, and hope this bird can handle whatever's going on. Soar towards the unfolding crisis. Golems and Endermen? Now this is a whole new level of supernatural. Two monsters, a giant golem and an Enderman. This just keeps getting better, doesn't it? Seems like our night's just getting started. So, what's the plan? How do we take down these behemoths? We've got them contained for now, but we can't let them wreak havoc. Your task is to disable them before they get active. Use whatever means necessary. According to the briefing, they're frozen for now. We need to neutralize them before they break free and wreak havoc. Agreed. Let's do this quietly and efficiently. We can't afford any slip-ups. 
All right, JJ, watch this. I'm gonna leap onto that Enderman from above and disable it ninja style. Ow, that wasn't as cool as I imagined. Easy there, Mikey. How about we stick to plan B? I'll approach from the bottom while you distract the golem. What do you say? Yeah, sounds less embarrassing. I'll keep the golem busy, and you handle the Enderman from below. Teamwork, right? Sneaky, but effective. Uh, JJ, this wasn't part of the plan. I didn't sign up for being an Enderman. And I certainly didn't plan on being a golem. This is a mess. Wait, guys, it's us. Mikey and JJ, no need to get trigger happy. Hold your fire. We're not the enemies here. This is a nightmare. We need to get out of their line of sight before we end up as targets. Keep moving, Mikey. We can't let them get the wrong idea. Maybe if we find a quiet place, we can figure out how to reverse this mess. I can't believe we're running from our own colleagues. This is insane. You must keep running, Mikey. We need to find a solution before things get even more out of hand. Quick, in here. Points to the abandoned garage. Good call, Mikey. Let's lay low until backup arrives. We need to sort this mess out. Once they see we're not a threat, they'll have to believe us. Agreed. Just need to ride this out. Backup should be here soon. We need to figure out how to reverse these transformations once backup arrives. What's the plan, officers? We can't stay like this forever. Yeah, our kids won't recognize us in these forms. We need a solution, fast. We've got a remedy for your little predicament. Drink these, and you'll be back to your normal selves. Bottoms up, JJ. Here's to returning to the world of regular detectives. That was one heck of a transformation. Thanks, officers. We owe you big time. Yeah, turning into monsters wasn't on our to-do list for tonight. Appreciate the help in turning us back into regular cops. We owe you one. Now we can finally reunite with our kids without terrifying them. Whoa, that was unexpected. I feel normal again. Me too. Back to being good old humans. Thank you, officers. We really appreciate this. Now we can finally reunite with our kids. They must have been worried sick. Let's get back to them as soon as possible. Two hours later. JJ, we gotta move. Something's happening and it's urgent. Mikey, slow down. What's going on? Why the rush? I'm a bit freaked out here, not knowing what's happening. No time for details, JJ. Trust me, it's important. We need to get to that place, and we need to get there fast. Mikey, you can't just drop this on me without any explanation. I need to know where we're going and why. This uncertainty is driving me crazy. Look, I wish I could fill you in, but there's no time. Just trust me, okay? We're in this together, and I wouldn't drag you into something if it wasn't crucial. Mikey, you're killing me with the suspense here. I need at least a hint or something. Is it dangerous? Are we in trouble? JJ, hold on a second. Did you invite these guards? They're banging on the door like we're in some kind of trouble. Mikey, I have no idea who they are. This is getting weirder by the minute. Maybe we should just stay inside and pretend we're not here. Agreed. We can't risk opening the door to strangers, especially with the urgency of our situation. They're yelling something about leaving, but I don't trust it. Come on, guys, I saw it in a movie once. It'll be like an adventure. We can be like superheroes escaping the bad guys. Little JJ, I appreciate your enthusiasm, but this isn't a movie. Climbing over a house isn't as easy as it looks on screen. JJ, I share your concerns, but what if it's our only shot at avoiding those guards? Mikey, I get that we're in a tight spot. But there has to be a better solution than risking life and limb. What if we find another way out? Get down here quickly, otherwise we'll go up. JJ, I agree with little JJ on the surprise element, but I'm with you on safety. Let's explore other options first. If push comes to shove, we can consider the daring escape, but only as a last resort. Hey, you two, what are you doing in there? Come out now. JJ, we've got no choice. We need to move now. Little JJ, stay close and let's make this quick. This is insane, Mikey. You two, come with us. We're here to help, and you're causing more trouble than necessary. What is going on? Why are you doing this? No time for questions. Just follow us, and everything will be explained. We're taking you to a military base for your safety. What? Why? Can't you at least tell us what's happening? We deserve some answers. This is messed up. But let's comply for now. Maybe we'll get some answers at this mysterious military base. I don't like this, Mikey. But you're right. We'll play along for now and see what they have to say. Now you will be sent to a special place. I did not want this. Fine. Lead the way. But you better start explaining soon. We're not going anywhere until we get some answers. 
This is insane! We get dragged into some enclosed space. Now they're talking about trials? What kind of twisted game is this? You have no choice. The trials are the only way forward. Once you leave this cell, there's no guarantee of safety or going back. This is unacceptable. You can't just throw us into some unknown situation without an explanation. What's the purpose of these trials, and why are we here? Questions will be answered later. Right now, focus on the trials ahead. It's your only chance to prove yourselves. We don't have much choice, JJ. It seems we're stuck in some messed up game. Let's take it one step at a time and figure out what these trials are about. Maybe we can find a way out. Fine. Let's get this over with. But mark my words. Once these trials are done, we better get some straight answers. I won't tolerate being kept in the dark any longer. Let's face whatever challenges they throw at us. But remember, we're not playing their game willingly. Mikey, this whole situation is beyond crazy. What do you think these trials are about and why are we here? I wish I had answers. It feels like we're in the middle of some twisted game, and I hate that we're being kept in the dark. Do you trust those guards? I can't shake off the feeling that they're not telling us the whole truth. Mikey, look around, zombies, seriously? This is like a nightmare come to life. We've got no choice, JJ. We need to keep moving forward and find a way out of this mess. Uh, JJ, this is insane. Zombies everywhere and those distress signals are giving me the creeps. What's our plan here? Mikey, I know it's daunting, but we can't turn back now. We stick together, move quietly. The beacons crying out might attract more undead, but we have to press on. JJ, look at this. Guns in the chest. Finally, something to ease my nerves. I'll take the shotgun. You grab the pistol. Time to show these undead some resistance. Good find, Mikey. This might just tip the scales in our favor. Stay focused. We've got a lot of ground to cover. These abandoned buildings give me the chills. What do you think brought us to this forsaken place? I wish I knew, JJ. One minute it's a routine mission, and the next, we're knee-deep in zombies. It's like we stumbled into a horror movie set. Let's clear this area so we can at least move without constantly checking our backs. Agreed, Mikey, but keep your guard up. Zombies could be lurking anywhere. JJ, did you see the size of that monster? This is insane! We tried to fight it, but it got us good! Now, we're part of this eerie opera turned into these weird creatures. How do we get out of this nightmare? Mikey, this is beyond messed up. We're like characters in some twisted play. We need to find a way to escape this monstrous fate. But how? We can't go back to normal life. We're stuck in this bizarre existence. Mikey, this is beyond surreal. We're transformed into Endermen, and we've become part of some bizarre internet opera. How do we escape this madness? We can't go back to a normal life. We're trapped in this digital nightmare. JJ, it's like we're characters in a twisted game. And you're right, society will never accept us as monsters from this opera. We need to find a way out. But how? We're stuck in this surreal existence. JJ, this flooded basement gives me the creeps, but we need answers. Let's explore and see what's down here. Keep an eye out for anything unusual. Agreed, Mikey. This place is giving me chills, but we can't turn back now. Wait, what's that? A hidden passage? Let's check it out. A portal! This could be our ticket out of here. I say we take the chance and step through. JJ, look around. This abandoned house feels familiar, and it's our only way out. Wait a minute. This is near our main house. How is that even possible? Mikey, this is downright bizarre. It's like we've stumbled upon a distorted version of our reality. Let's be cautious. We might encounter more unexpected twists. But if this is a way back home, we can't ignore it. JJ, our kids are right there! But they don't recognize us in this Enderman form. This is heartbreaking. We need to approach them carefully. Let them know we're still their parents. It's heart-wrenching, Mikey. They're scared of us. Let's try to calm them down. Kids, wait. Don't be afraid. We're your parents, even if we look different now. We know things only your mom and dad would know. Remember the time we went camping and got caught in that unexpected rainstorm? Or the secret handshake we made up together? We're still your mom and dad, despite our appearance. Ask us anything. We'll prove it. Kids, it's us. We might look different, but our love for you hasn't changed. We're here to protect you. 
Ask us anything. Mom? Dad? Is it really you? Yes, sweetie, it's us. We may look different, but our love for you is unchanged. Kids, we need your help. There's a potion nearby that can return us to our normal selves. There's a shop nearby that sells it. Can you go get it for us? We promise, kids. We'll be right here waiting for you. Just be careful and come back as soon as you can. We love you both. Finally, back to our normal selves. Human again. But wait, what's happening? The police? You are suspected of a crime you will now be arrested for being in the city. Officer, there's been a misunderstanding. We were trapped in a bizarre situation, transformed into monsters against our will. We just got back to normal. We're not criminals. Save it for the station. We received reports of monstrous creatures in the area. You fit the description. You'll have to come with us for questioning. Officer, please. Our kids just got us a potion to return us to normal. We're innocent. This is all a mistake. We have witnesses who can vouch for us. Our own children helped us reverse the transformation. You can't arrest us for something beyond our control. This is unreal. We just wanted to go back to our normal lives. Now we're being treated like criminals. We'll see about that at the station. You can explain your story to the authorities. Until then, you're under arrest. Kids, you brought the potion. That's incredible. But how do we get it? The police are not listening and we're stuck here. We appreciate your efforts, but we need a way inside. What's your plan, kiddos? We're running out of time with the police here. Mom, Dad, we've got a plan. We can distract the police, create a diversion, and slip you the potion. Just trust us. Be careful, kids. We don't want you getting into trouble. But if you think it'll work, go ahead. We trust you. A tunnel? You kids managed to dig a tunnel to the prison? That's incredible! You've always been resourceful, but this is beyond belief. We can escape through the tunnel? That's amazing, kids. Thank you for thinking ahead. Let's get out of here together. Mom, Dad, we want our family back. We want you both safe and with us. Here, drink the return elixirs. Let's go home. I can't believe this is happening. To think we were just facing arrest, and now we have a way out, thanks to you both. It's working. We're back to being ourselves. Thank you kids for everything. Let's go home, where we belong. We're so proud of you both. Let's leave this nightmare behind and embrace the life we've missed. Together, as a family. Kids, you saved us from a nightmare! We can't thank you enough for your courage and quick thinking. Now, we get to live a normal life together. You've shown incredible strength and love and we are beyond grateful. We're a family and nothing can tear us apart. Let's cherish every moment together from now on. That's the plan, kiddos! From now on, it's just the four of us, navigating the ups and downs of life. Yeah, Mikey. They're acting strangely. Look at that one. Seems like he needs to use the restroom. I'll take him. He's still too little to navigate on his own. Yeah, it's weird. One of the kids looks like he needs the bathroom. I'll take him. He's still little and might not know his way around. Good idea. Let's make sure he gets to the restroom safely. Kids can be unpredictable sometimes. One eternity later. Hey there, little buddy. Did everything go okay in the bathroom? Uh, yeah. But look! Oh no, how did that happen? Don't worry, it's just a little prank. Let's head to the sea, wash it off, and get back to playing. Kids can be mischievous. Don't let it ruin the fun. We'll sort it out, and you'll be good as new. All right, kiddo. Let's head to the sea and wash off that unexpected surprise. It's just a harmless prank. No need to let it spoil the fun. Kids will be kids, right? We'll clean up, and then you can join the others for more playground adventures. No problem, buddy. We're here to make sure you have a great time on the playground. One day later. Let's go to the store, grab something to eat, see what we can buy, take a walk. And we also need to go to grandma's. She asked us to come by and help her with something. Oh no, those are soldiers. We need to run. No, Mikey, it's too late. They've outflanked us. We won't get out. They want us to board the bus. There's no point in trying to escape anymore. Let's take our seats. Two hours later. Oh, we finally arrived? Where is this? Is this their base? What do they want from us here? Why did they kidnap us like this? Judging by the size, this must be their base. We'll probably be serving here, but why? Yes, why did you kidnap us and bring us here against our will? Listen to me, you scoundrels. The games are over. You're soldiers now, and I'm your commander. You will listen to me without complaints or whining. Tears. 
No, we won't. I'm not interested. Here's your uniform. Put it on and get ready for trials. Okay, we're ready to take the trials, and then you'll let us go. Hurry up, Mikey. All right, let's go. But you know what you're doing. We have to get out of here. I can't stay here. No, Mikey, I don't know, but I hope they'll let us go after we pass the trials. Let's do this. Well, the uniform looks good, fits nicely, it suits your face. Yes, thank you, Mikey, but I don't want to linger in it for long. Look, a treadmill, let's start by running on it. Wow! I haven't run on a treadmill in a long time. Where have we ended up and why? It feels like a prison. My friend told me that they make people here do jobs that only follow orders. I don't know, this is a gym. There's a boxing bag and weights. We should see what else is here. I like it so far. I don't know about you, but I want to go home quickly before they turn us into robots here. I don't know what you're talking about. How can they turn us into robots? Are you making this up? Well, look around. Look at the soldiers, the place. Everything is so dull, nothing cheerful. How can anyone live here for two years? How can you not have fun? They even gave us weapons to shoot here. Look how well I'm doing. What do you think they're doing this for? Giving us weapons, training us to be soldiers so we can go to war. I'm afraid they might kill us there. I'll take the rifle, but how can they expect us to be soldiers? We're just kids. They'll check on us soon and let us go. Everything will be fine. Don't worry. Let's have fun while we can. Look, there's an AK-47 assault rifle. Where else would you be able to hold it, shoot it, and not have to pay for anything? It's all free. That's great. It's Kalashnikov's creation, but I didn't really want to do this. Mikey, let's not escalate the situation. Relax and just have some fun. Shoot a bit. Check out how much weaponry there is. All right, but if we get stuck here, it'll be your fault, and I won't forget it. The weapon shoots pretty well. Right on target. Maybe we could join the snipers with our skills. I don't think we shoot that well. Look at how many shots you missed. They don't take people like us for snipers. You're right. It's not for us. We're not great shooters. Maybe we should join the infantry. Let's go to the test track. Look at those huge tanks. I've never seen them up close. I'd love to sit behind the wheel and drive one. We could just drive away from here, and no one would stop us. Yeah, look, we need to crawl underneath. You go first. Hey, isn't that dangerous? It could harm our health and no one will help us here. Come on, it'll be fine. We're professionals at crawling around anywhere. We've done it so many times and everything was fine. Oh, it's a shame about the uniform. We'll have to crawl on the ground. Is there a washing machine here? I don't think so. Most likely, we'll have to wash it by hand. Oh no, I don't know how. My wife always did the laundry. What will I do now? Let's jump out of here quickly. We need to finish this, but be careful not to get hurt. They won't let us go if we're injured. Ouch, that hurts. I fell, but I'm okay. Mikey, because of you, I fell too. Let's climb back up. We have to get through this. Hey, stop it. I'll go first. No, it's my turn to go first now. You were first and didn't make it, so I will. You see, you didn't make it either, so I'll go now. Well, then you go. It's your turn now, and I'll watch how you fall. Haha, <laughs> wait, I won't fall. Everything's going well for me, but there are no corners here to descend further. And then you fall down. Look, we've passed this trial. Look, another big tank. I hope it won't start moving. We need to crawl under it. Wow, you've become fearless. You went first, even though you say you don't like it here. You're worried about the uniform getting dirty. I think we won't get out of here easily. We'll have to get used to it. They can wash the uniform later. Okay, let's move on. Look, is that a shooting range or something? Look, there's a new armored uniform. Over there behind you, there's one for you. Check it out. Let's change. What's in the chest? Oh, there are lots of bullets. We'll probably have a shootout here. Interesting. Wow, so many bullets. I've never seen so many before. We'll probably have to shoot a lot. I wonder at what. Let's pay close attention to what's next. Maybe there will be targets or something like in a shooting range. No, it's not targets. And it's not a shooting range at all. These are real trials. So we shot everyone. What's next? I think we've passed, but they're not letting us go. Let's wait a bit longer. Look, a wall appeared. This must be the next level. There will probably be more of them. There are a lot more of them. Shoot more accurately. We shouldn't die here. I want to go home to my wife. Mikey, I also want to go home alive. They're shooting at us too. Stay strong. It seems we have a little left and we will win. You're right. It'll be over soon and maybe they'll let us out of here. Yes, you did it. We did it. What's next? I don't know, but we did great. We're not just winners. We're strong. Oh no, what's this? Another one? I don't want to. I want to go out. No, it's not possible. What will happen next? Oh no, there are even more of them. I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Let's kill them before they get closer. I'm trying. Oh no, behind you. I'll deal with him. Don't let others get closer. We can handle them. Even though there are many, they are weak against us and our weapons. Look, they're falling like dominoes. They're just zombies, and we'll destroy them. 
There are just a few left. You're right. There's some kind of zombies or mutants, but they shoot fire. Since when do regular soldiers have mutants and zombies? Maybe they're aliens. I've heard about such things. Maybe we're in Area 51. I've been told about it. No, I don't know what you're talking about, but we won and they'll probably let us out of here. We've completed everything. Can we go home now? Hello? Let us out. We've completed your task. Can you hear us? Take us away from here. Do you think they'll hear us? Let's go to the door and knock. Maybe they'll open it. Sure, let's go. Oh, look, it opened. And do you hear the helicopter? It will take us away. Hey, helicopter, take me on a flight. Yeah, land quickly. We want to leave here. Yeah, it's landing. Let's step back so it doesn't hit us. It might not see us. I wonder who's in there and if they'll take us away from here. They said we should jump with a parachute. It's another trial. Hold on to me. I think you'll manage. Yeah, I'm jumping after you. Wow, this is so cool. It reminds me of some games. The main thing is for the parachute to open so we don't hit trees or crash into the ground. Yeah, Mikey, everything will be fine. The parachute opened, but where do we need to land? They didn't tell me. Do you see the yellow circle? We probably need to land there or closer to that place. I hope you can control the parachute because my wife asked me to skydive long ago, but I was afraid. Now we have the opportunity for a free jump. I'm almost landing, but the wind is carrying me towards some trees. Oh no, we don't want to go there. Let's try another direction. Wow, it's really dangerous between the trees. Hooray, I'm lucky I didn't hit a tree. I'm landing now, but I'm not hitting the circle. Hooray, I landed safely. You're still flying. You're still in the air, but very close to landing. I'll wait for you to land, and then we'll continue together. Oh, you're here already? We're on the yellow circle? Let's go to the center and see what else they have prepared for us. Let's go. You reminded me about food, and I want to eat. Let's go ask where we can eat. Let's go quickly. Run to the commander. Ask about food, because they didn't let us go eat in the morning. Do you think they'll feed us? They don't seem like the kind of people who feed you when you want. They have a schedule. So guys, now you've become soldiers. You will serve your country and live here. Let's go, I'll show you your bed where you'll sleep from 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. Take your bunks and get ready for the next missions. Looks like I was wrong. They do feed us in the morning and evening. So I see. Well, okay, let's get undressed and go to bed. Let's sleep and see what happens. So, we need to take a break from what happened today. Have a good night's sleep. Same to you. Hey guys, wake up already. We need to get out of here as soon as possible. Mikey, wake me up because I must still be asleep as I see my wife here. Okay guys, enough playing around. Did you think you could hide from us here? We came to rescue you and take you away from here. Of course, we just want to escape from here and go home. Then get us out of here quickly. Shh, quietly follow me. There's no one here. All right, but do you know where to go and how to get out? Okay, let's quickly go right by the plane. Don't ask unnecessary questions. I want to get out of here, not get caught for escaping from the cell. We can't let anyone see us. I don't see anyone, so we can go further. Guys, there's the exit. Let's go there quietly. We'll be picked up by a car. Got it. Let's go quickly and stay low to avoid being noticed. Of course, it's dark here. They shouldn't notice us. We're like ninjas hiding. We just need masks on our faces. Quiet, he's coming. Stand still so he doesn't see us. We're by the doors. The exit is here. Great, we made it out. We're free now. Hooray! We made it out. I can't believe it worked. One day later. Mikey, we don't have much time. We need to quickly retrieve the diamonds from the secret base. It has been overrun by zombie mutants, so we need to be careful and eliminate them if possible. Let's go then. We've prepared for this mission for so long and I've been waiting for it my whole life. You should have been informed about the task. I hope you're ready to do everything quickly and efficiently, leaving no traces of our involvement and not leaving a single zombie. Everything must be destroyed and the diamonds must be taken. They are very valuable to us. It's too late to back out of the task now. Great, let's do this. What's our plan? Understood, let's improvise and adapt as we go. Got it. I see the tower in the distance. That's our first point. Let's head there quietly. All right, I'm following you. I hope you know what to do and how we can take the position and clear it. Let's get closer and see what the situation is like and figure out how we can accomplish the task. Let's shoot. They're already here. We won't be able to sneak in quietly. Let's stick to plan B. Mikey, we didn't have a plan A. So where did plan B come from? Anyway, just kill them. I'm trying to shoot as many of them as possible, but there are so many. Why did they send just the two of us? Couldn't they send a team or even an army? It would have been more successful in completing the mission. Because it's a secret mission. Nobody should know about it. If we send an army, it will be very suspicious where they were sent, and the commander will have questions. We seem to have taken out everyone. What's next? Where do we go? 
I see a bunker over there. We need to go there. There will be the information we need. Well, let's do it. I'll cover you. There's no one here. There's a laptop here. It has coordinates of the base we need to reach and all the information about the base. What's next? Are we going there? Here, take this first aid kit to regain your strength and health. You're welcome. I forgot to bring food. Let's hurry to the mission. I looked at the coordinates. I'll show you which way we need to go. Let's go there. Follow me quickly on foot to avoid attracting attention. I'll cover you if something goes wrong. Oh no, there's a broken bridge. How do we get there? There are no detours. What should we do? Let's jump. It's like on our training ground. We've done this before. I think we can handle it here too. Look, there's ventilation. It could blow us down. Be careful and watch your step. Let's do it with momentum. You can only jump here. Just don't look down. It's high there. Oh, Mikey, I did it. It wasn't as hard as I thought. But look, there are lasers here. They can cut us with a single beam of light. We need to jump carefully. Let's do it together. I'm jumping with you. Just be careful. There are many of them here. What's next for us here? I see a green and a red block. You probably go left and I'll go right. Oh, look, zombies are coming out. Let's shoot so they don't hinder hey. us. How can I help destroy hey. them? Oh, they're resilient pests. Where did they come from anyway? Hey. Oh, no, it's a trap. They hid from us and wanted to attack us from behind. I read some secret information. Hey. It's some kind of virus that got out of control and infected people after some experiments. So you mean to say that these are the same people as us, but they got infected with the virus and have now become zombies? In short, yes, but they're already dead. They're walking dead, so you don't have to pity them. They just want to bite us and infect us with their virus. If it's that serious, then we can't leave a single one alive. We need to destroy them all. We'll be heroes if we return from here to save the world from zombies. Wow, this is such an important task. But if it's secret, how will the world know that we saved it if we can't tell anyone? Here we are at the doors. We need to swipe the card. Did you take it? Yes, I took the card. Let's move on. So, where are the diamonds? Oh, I see explosives. We probably need to blow everything up. Oh, here are our precious diamonds. Let's take them. Yes, I took the explosives. Let's start planting them. Yes, let's plant everything. There should be a very big explosion here so that nothing is left. The main thing is for us to escape in time so that we don't get caught here either. Haha, <laughs> we'll escape in time. Everything will be fine as long as everything goes according to plan. It's strange that you didn't tell me about the plan. We still have a lot of explosives to place here. I think after such an explosion, there won't be anything left, not even the planet. No, the planet should remain. We still need to get home, but first, let's see the explosion of this awful place. I'm leaving. Are you coming or do you want to stay? Yes, I'm going too. There's nothing more to do here. I'm looking at how much explosives we planted. I've never seen so much in one place before. I haven't seen so much either, but there's a first time for everything. I'm going down and placing more explosives there. But it's interesting why the commander is so afraid that no one will find out about it. It's strange. They could have just sent a rocket here, and it would have been much easier for both us and them. It's all strange. I don't know, Mikey. It's really strange. All these secrets, but we're not paid to think. We're paid for a big, very big boom. I love big explosions, too. But if you're not interested in why this happened, then we'll wait. Maybe someday they'll tell us where these diamonds came from, where the zombies came from, and why this place will disappear from the face of the Earth. Maybe you're right, and time will give us the answers to these questions, but not now. And now comes the most enjoyable part of this task, but we need to step back a sufficient distance from here. Oh no, look, there's a lot of fire. I'm afraid the explosive might detonate before the set time. Then it's time to get out of here. The sooner we get out, the better. I agree with you. Let's go somewhere high and watch the explosion. Let's go find a place in the front row. I hear something hissing. Could it be that the explosive is catching fire? Yes, it's the explosive. Hide quickly and let's watch. Oh, that's it. I was hoping for a huge explosion. It seems like there was a defective explosive, but it doesn't matter. We made it and we're alive. Hooray! And here are our diamonds. Hooray, we did it.